Hi guys! So today I went to go shop at Giant and they were having a ton of sales today. And this is the long wet receipt. It's like raining outside and I have to carry like these all, all these bags by myself. So um, I used some coupons of course today. I clicked them on through the Giant app and they were giving away flexible points which can be earned or redeemed for gas or either money towards your next purchase. So today's total flexible points that I earned on this visit was 245 points, which is a lot. That's automatically either 20 cents off gas or $2 off your next purchase. We usually go for the gas though. Have you guys seen those gas prices? All right, so we're gonna start off with the produce. Now that we have little guinea pigs, we're trying to give them the freshest things to eat that are packed with vitamin C. So we got a big organic bag of kale. We can use this too for smoothies. So we got one bag of those. We got some organic tomatoes on the vine. Um, these tend to be sweeter and they tend to stay firmer when they're on the vine, I'm noticing. So tomatoes. Some yellow onion. Of course, avocado. We've been eating salads almost every single meal for dinner, so we got some romaine lettuce. I have not had kimchi in the fridge for about three weeks now, which is kind of sad. So I bought a whole thing of Napa cabbage. I'm gonna whip up some kimchi maybe this weekend. We have some celery. This was also organic. And also in the organic air, um, area was these carrots. I do want to point out that these items here in the organic section were cheaper for some reason, like, or they had a sale. So I had picked up another bag of celery first, just the giant brand, and then I went to the organic section and I realized that this was cheaper and it's organic. Same thing with the carrots. So it doesn't hurt to look at the organic section just because you can get some really great deals for it. Um, and I feel a little bit better knowing it's organic. And if it's cheaper, why the heck not? And of course I got some potatoes. I'm gonna make some like chicken soup this week. So that was all the produce. Um, I feel pretty good eating all these greens and veggies. But on to the less healthier things. Also on sale were these new Nature Valley mini sandwiches. They were on sale for $1.77, which is a great deal. I'm gonna try this out and I bought my boyfriend's favorite, Nature Valley um, dark chocolate crunch. Squeezable sour cream by Daisy. This is my favorite, no mess, no spoons necessary. Just squeeze it on there. I'm telling you, these things were heavy today. Um, we have some pumpernickel bread. For some reason, my boyfriend always points this out, but we never eat it. Like, he's curious about it, but he doesn't put it in the cart. I don't know. So I got this for him. Uh, we're going to try it out for breakfast sandwiches this week. Hummus. Oh, we got these little apple sticks for the little pigs. We're gonna see if they like these or not. Um, and they finally, Giant has the section for guinea pig stuff, so, or just for small pets. So I thought that was great. So we're gonna give, them a, uh, give this a try later. Yogurt. Always on sale, the Yoplait brand, always, always on sale. I think they were going for 10 for four right now. Idaho steak, um, critical fries. We love potatoes, what well, I do. Chorizo. Organic um, chicken wings. Got two of these. Have the fat-free hazelnut creamer. So quick update. I bought this in my last haul. The cookies and cream by Chobani. Um, first thing I want to point out is that 
where is it? Let me see if, if my assumptions are right. Okay. This doesn't expire until November, 2021. I bought this in May and I realized um, it expires in like two weeks. And I was just trying to understand why, maybe because it's like, or like no artificial anything or GMOs or whatever. It's, I guess it's just healthier or just more organic. Maybe that's why it expires sooner, but I was a little caught off guard and I, now I'm like trying my best to finish this before it goes bad. Um, but I love the hazelnut one from um, Nestle Toll House or Nestle. So I'm trying to get through this one. This was too sweet, by the way. For someone who loves sweet things, this was actually too sweet. Got some organic or uh, avo. <laughs> organic extra virgin olive oil. Again, this was on sale right next to the one that was not organic. So I was like, why not? You know? So I got this one. This was also on sale with the coupon. So I saved a lot of money on this. Fat free milk. And these little cans, they're always convenient to have. I usually go diet with this one for my boyfriend, but cherry Coke just sounded delicious. So we got those. Bananas. Eggs. Bell peppers. I knew I was missing something. And since I did not want to carry a whole watermelon in by myself, I just got a quarter thing of watermelon because there's more space in the fridge for this. All right, and some people left their coupons behind, so I took them because, well, this one's the one that came out for me. Um, the creamer with Hagen dazs yes, yes, save $1. Stouffer's, we don't really eat that. And ooh, feel good ice cream. These are actually good coupons. I don't know why people left it. So I just took it. All right guys, that's the end of the food haul.